So I almost just fell in the trash right there where I belong. <laughs> Salut les first morning waking up actually on the island. The night wasn't that bad, like, but uh, this explains this face. Now it's way too hot, so it's time to go get water, brush the teeth, pee, and then go to a better place, which means not heaven, because we are already there. <laughs> it means a uh, chill garden, and I'm gonna strategize for um, whatever I have to do to get all the stamps today. So let's go do that. My friend Sonia has one of those. What's the name of those? I don't even know. I'm gonna try to uh, to inflate it for the first time. Ramp it, it. Run. What? Oh, run. Yes. I run. My, my English. Okay, you oh. do it. You do it. Uh, <laughs> that did not work at all. All right. Good luck. <laughs> Let's try to see now which steps we can have first. I think everything starts at 10 a.m. Uh, although I didn't check this year, so I'm gonna check in the passport. And then we can start the quest and hopefully have a great present at the end. You want to record it? Yes, please. There you go. Thank you very much. Arriving at point number two on the map, uh, the Before I Die place. Last year I wrote Siget 2018. I want to be original, so I'm probably gonna put Siget 19. I'm not sure though, but I'm getting the stamp first of all. Thank you. You're welcome. It's gonna go pretty quick today, but uh, what I remember from last year is that the important for me is that I go get a beer at some point, so that's gonna be one of the parts of my own challenge. Yeah, let's go get the NGO ones then. Okay, there should be a third one here, but I cannot see... Oh, I think I got it. It was hidden behind. <laughs> Let's go. So when you guys get all your stamps in the place, you have to go to the immigration office. And uh, I will be back in a couple hours, I guess. It's gonna take a while, but it's gonna be fun. So, I almost just fell in the trash right there where I belong. <laughs> I think it's really great what they do with all these NGOs. It really respects the, the spirit of the festival, which is about love, and they try to make a difference. So I think it's, it's pretty amazing. As I'm passing through this amazing decor, I also got myself a beer, because right now I have... Okay, I don't want to go in the picture. <laughs> now I have a little break, so it's about time that uh, this would happen. This one was fairly clean, it didn't smell anything, but uh, still super hot and I still <laughs> sweat really bad. I'm always impressed by that thing, but I'm not gonna try because, uh, you know, my ankle. <laughs> not sure that's the best move to do. So as we saw last year, uh, there is an actual supermarket inside the festival, which is called Aldi. It's, it's, a, it's a German um, supermarket, it's supposed to be cheap. I don't know if it's cheaper than the other thing. Oh, look, Frosco. Maybe that's where I should have gone to have cut my hair. I still haven't seen any of you guys, uh, so I didn't get any opinion on how it is behind, but if I do today, I will I will not forget to ask that. Let's go back on the subject. Aldi, the supermarket, I'm gonna go inside and I'm gonna see if I can find some food, and I'm gonna check if the prices are better than in the rest of the festival, so that you guys can know for next year. Whoa, this looks so huge, it's bigger than my head. Um, but this kind of feel healthier to eat than the actual language and I know it's it's not because there is more thing on it but it's a bit smaller and there are other tastes involved in it so it feels less than that but this is really good you guys should try it all right actually the queue is really long uh, so I'm not gonna queue up I'm not gonna uh, I'm not gonna wait to get in but I guess if the queue is really big that probably means that it's it is actually cheaper but maybe if some of you have tried it you can tell the others in the comments below if if that is cheaper or not. And instead of going into Aldi, I found a recycled dragon. I think that's worth much more. Oh, and a dragonfly. I'm gonna have to take a break somewhere to get some food. There is, oh yeah, there is this one place where um, I go at every single festival in Hungary. 
Uh, it's called Pasta Nostra. I think it I think it kind of belongs to the festival itself. And it's only 2000, but there is more and more and more than enough to be full for a long time. So that's my go-to place. Apart from, of course, bringing your food from Ocean. Believe it or not, I was just with some of my friends. It looks like I've been alone the whole time, but I'm not. Uh, we were discussing what would be like the number one sentence that has been pronounced on the island. Probably it's where are you from? What do you guys think? What what is for you the number one? So I have a question for you. Yeah. What do you think is the sentence that has been the most pronounced on the island this week? This week? Yeah, yeah. I don't know. Really, I actually I don't know. About I was thinking about where are you from? Ah, okay. From Israel. Oh, I have another question though. Yeah. Yesterday I shaved my hair on my okay. own because I just I hated it. Okay. And I probably did a really bad job and I no, want to it's, see. It's okay. But no, it is okay. It's okay. You oh, can make okay. out. All right, cool. Thank you. Okay, have a nice day. <laughs> so when I was telling you guys that uh, they are not joking about how much food they gave you and it's more than enough. Look at this, like all the cheese, all the sauce, and then we have those big tartellini with the meat as well. It's really worth it. That's that's one of the most worth it food on the island and I'm really dark because I'm in the shadow because I want to eat and I don't want to die. See you after... I was gonna say dinner, it's lunch. Bon appétit. Yo et in Hungarian. I appreciate the technique. And if we could just reach uh, 1,000 subscribers after the cigarette, that would be amazing because I would start getting monetized again. Thank you, Logan Paul, by the way. <sighs> better, much better. Oh, guys, I'm seeing something amazing. This guy is gonna be my best friend for the day. Because <sighs> I'm safe. <laughs> Where are you guys from? Croatia. Croatia. Woo! <laughs> Your videos are great and Petrol is great. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I have a question because um, there was one guy that told me something, but I need uh, I need the opinions of girls, right? I want to know <laughs> how bad it is behind here. It's really good. It's good. Thank you so much for lying for me. I feel much better. <laughs> so I'm now heading to the Excess Land, and it's a place where they teach you. They don't teach you, but they make you experience what the people with disabilities experience when they go to festivals, when they do sports, when they do pretty much everything in life that we take for granted. And it's very humbling. You learn a lot from it. So uh, we're going there. I uh, got lost, but that's where I'm going now. All Zigan, you are the best. Is this? This plant is the best in the world. Yeah, really? I love it. Where are you guys from? We are yeah, from Ukraine. Ukraine. Oh, Ukraine. Wow. You have been really happy since the beginning of this video. <laughs> so Killian is going to learn how to speak with his hands. You're already worse than me, so that's good. <laughs> Here with uh, what's your name? Dennis. Dennis, nice to meet you. Where are you from? I'm from Turkey. Turkey, awesome. So he was just telling me that he came to the festival because of my videos. Yep. Like for real, or are you just telling me? No, for real. That's I, amazing. Uh, I was looking at the festival and so I saw your videos. And you looks like he's chilling. The festival looks nice at the top. Cool, well, I'm super glad. And are you enjoying it so far? Yeah. So, so good tips, yeah? Yeah, good tips. Awesome, good tips. man. Have a good night. Ciao. That's also a good tip, guys, if you can get your hands on one bottle, no matter where it is, and then just fill it with the cold, fresh, and free water. That's the one that tastes the best. Although, that is from the toilets a little bit, so I don't know if it's like a closed circuit, and we are just... I prefer not to think about it. <laughs> so how did you guys know about the festival? Because of you! I knew that, they just told me, that's amazing. <laughs> did you have a good week so far? Yes, yes. very good. What was your favorite concert? Montfredense! Yes, last night. What is this? Oh, right. You've never heard of Montfredense. What is this Montfredense? Uh, I'm playing with you guys. <laughs> Actually, I'm not that. <laughs> Terrible! Have yes. a good night. <laughs> Thank you. And we have the most famous comedian on the island playing in an hour at the Magic Mirror. How do you feel now? I feel great. <laughs> Hot. <laughs> Someone else recognized me. I like your guitar here. Yeah, thank you. How I long does it take? 
Oh, she said that even if you shower, it won't come off. All so right. Maybe it's stuck for a few days. Oh, <laughs> maybe forever. Yeah. Who are you looking forward to tonight? Uh, Dua Lipa, of course. All right. Of course. Yeah. By the way, Dua Lipa, if you look, uh, if you watch this video, uh, we would like to meet you after the concert. Yeah. Even really though this like video is gonna be out later, but that's okay. Na 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 <laughs> Thank you. Ah, uh, it's only one left. And I really hope they didn't run out of the present because I'm, I'm gonna cry. Not because I've been doing this for a long time today. You know what? What the best part about all these people knowing me and coming to say hi was? So far, at one point, a girl came to me with her phone like this and smiling at me, and I thought, okay, you want a picture? She said yes, and she didn't want me inside. <laughs> it was just a normal picture. I, I was like, oh, maybe my head is getting too big after this. <laughs> Hello, you're my last one. Yay, congratulations. Thank you. I just left everyone because I'm the only one actually doing this quest. Uh, I just finished and I'm on my way to the immigration office. I'm really hoping I'm gonna get that treasure and share it with you what it is because it's okay because I guess when this video comes out, the festival will be over so I'm not gonna be spoiling it too much for you guys. I don't I don't know how many kilometers I've done today. It's probably a lot. Uh, my ankle is doing better. But probably after today, not so much. Oh well. Finally got what I was here for. Uh, and I won't be needing this anymore because the treasure is a water bottle. So it's perfect. Thank you, Sigad. Clap, cheer. Send your slump to the stage area and behold the brilliant for Stand Out. Yeah! Move this out the way so you guys can see me. <laughs> Thank you ladies and gentlemen, that's all for me tonight. My name is Dan now. Good night. It's time for the post interview. Post interview, let's go. How, how did it go? It was great. There was a lot more people than last year. Like. Yeah. So where can people find you? You can find me at it's standout, it's underscore standout. Yeah, don't forget the underscore because I think last year last year I forgot the underscore. <laughs> First time in the beach area at night, it's really chill, we wanted to avoid the dust because it's building a lot. And I think that's gonna be it for the vlog for today, I'm super glad that we got the water bottle. Don't forget that it's all about positivity, ride the happiness wave, and I'll see you at the end of it with my next video.